What is happening, my Android friends? Welcome to another edition of App Updates. That's right, it is hump day, when is day? And you know how Google loves to update their core apps. And holy crap, did they do that today? And uh, we're going to talk about some of them. Uh, a lot of changes coming to these core apps. Uh, one specific change that we've been waiting for, and it's pretty awesome. So let's get started. Chromecast updates with mirroring support on select, yes, select devices. This means you can actually mirror your home screen on, you know, what's ever on your device onto your TV and holy crap is it great. Now not every device can do this folks. I mean sadly they can't. It's just the way it is in the Android world but a lot of devices can and as you can see the list right here pretty much if you have a Nexus you're good. Pretty much if you have a Galaxy S device that is S4 and above you're good. And the notes everything like that you got the one M7 GP I mean it's got to be the Google Play edition sadly but yeah. But anyways the LG G Pro 2, the G2, the G3 and support for additional devices will be coming soon, so you must be patient, but it is awesome. It's great that we can do this. I think the next step is just, you know, running some emulators, right, on your device and then playing them on your screen. I mean, that's pretty much the next thing. So then you'll be able to play, like, a, a an old Nintendo game, a Sega Genesis, man. Freaking Streets of Rage. Who played that when they were a kid? I love Streets of Rage on uh, Sega Genesis. Just play that right on your TV through your Chromecast and your device. That, that'll be cool. That would be pretty cool. So uh, hopefully you guys got the update. If you don't, I'll have the link down below. Get it on your device. Let me know what you think of it. All right, then we got the camera. It sees a nice update that has remote shutter and a revamped panorama UI. Okay, now the big thing on this one is it's got Android Wear support. So now you have remote, you know, if you set up your phone and you have an Android Wear device, you could do that whole awesome thing where you could just go click and boom, there you go. You don't, <laughs> maybe this could cut off the, 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 the the god awful selfie epidemic where everybody just holds up their phone to a dirty mirror and they're looking, ugh. God, I hate that, don't you? There's so many. You go on Instagram, you see that at least once or twice a day where these girls are just taking pictures and you're, they're holding up their device and they're looking at it. It's like, okay, prop it up. Prop it up now. <laughs> well, obviously, they had to get an Android Wear smartwatch, but this could, I mean, I'm just, I hate that. It's like, it's just such a pet peeve. And I'm just wondering too, because I don't know, I don't know about you guys, but the, the Google camera, it has a timer on it. So if you're going to take a picture of yourself, why don't you prop it up somewhere and hit the timer? <sighs> it's just that selfie epidemic, man, I tell you, but uh, that's pretty cool. And uh, apparently it's rolling, it's, it's rocking pretty good, hopefully. I haven't really tried it yet, but uh, maybe you guys have. I don't have an Android Wear watch, and anybody out there that has one, I really hate you right now. I don't really hate you. I just It's just jealousy. That's all. That's all sour grapes, right? Anyways, um, if you don't have uh, the new camera, uh, check down the links below. Of course, I'll have it for you. And uh, if you have an Android Wear device, let me know if the remote shutter works. Gmail gets a nice little update. It updates to version 4.9, and now we have Google Drive attachments. Yay! That's what we needed. I mean, that's what's awesome about these little updates. It might be a little minor, but they're little things that we just need, that we want. And we love this integration with all our Google Core apps, and especially Drive with all your documents and everything like that. It's good stuff. So if you don't have version 4.9, check your version and see if you have it. If you don't, check down links below. And that's pretty much all I have for you on Google Update Day. Uh, I think there were some minor updates to some of the other apps. Uh, I'll have uh, our little download website called Gaps Early. If you want to check that out, click click on the website, check and see if you have the updated Google Core apps. We have them all there for you. Hopefully they're all updated. So uh, check that out and also hit that like thumbs up button if you guys would be so kind. Subscribe to the Android Spin channel if you have not already. And uh, there's, like I said, there's a bunch of stuff to click down there. A lot of clickable stuff, social media, other websites. Have fun with it. Well, all right, guys, I am David, your Android junkie at AndroidSpin.com. And this has been App Updates. Hopefully you've been updated. Hopefully you're digging that Chromecast thing. It's pretty great. Fantastic. And yes, I, I, I mean, a lot of people might not care for that whole emulator thing being on the TV, but I think a lot of you kind of do. It'd be kind of cool to have, you know, play your games like that. You know, why not? All right, guys, talk to you later.